Hi, I'm Jeffrey Schmidt at Jeffrey Schmidt Music, and I have a bass pedal shootout for you today. Both of these pedals are bass overdrives, and so it's going to be the Electro Harmonics Bass Soul Food versus the Tech 21 Paradriver DI. And here's the setup I'm going to be running today. I'm going to be using my Sire P7 bass, going into one of the overdrive pedals, going into the radial JDI, and that's where the signal splits. After the signal splits out of the radial JDI, we have one part that goes to the Ampeg BA-112 that's being recorded by an RE-20 microphone heading into a GAP Pre-73 DLX and then into a warm WA-76 compressor. The other signal that comes out of the radial goes directly to the Dayking Mic Pre-1 and into another warm WA-76 compressor. So this is our amp signal, of course, and this is our DI signal. So let's listen to the audio samples. First, we're going to listen to the amp samples. Next, we're going to listen to the DI signals. And lastly, we're going to listen to the AMP and DI signals together as it might be in a mix. So now that you've heard all of the audio samples, let me know which pedal you prefer. I think it would probably depend upon the style of music that you're into or the period of music that, uh, that you like listening to. Obviously, the Tech 21 sounds a little bit more modern than the, uh, the bass soul food, which is more of kind of a 70s type sound. Thank you very much for tuning in. I hope you have a great day. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future, please subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye. So, in terms of technical details, if you want to know how my settings were, in order to make this fair, I tried to keep the settings on the pedals as neutral as possible. So, these are the settings that I had on the, um, on the Tech 21. And so I kept the treble, the mid, and the bass all in neutral. I kept the blend also at 12 o'clock. That means that the mix coming out of the pedal was half affected and half not affected by the overdrive. I had the drive on the Tech 21 at 3 o'clock, which is what sounded good to me on the mix I was working on. And then similarly, I had the blend at 12 o'clock on the soul food and the treble control also at 12 o'clock in the neutral position. And in order to try to match the level of saturation that was coming out of the Tech 21, I ended up maxing out the drive on the soul food. As you've heard, of course, the the overdrive given by the Soul Food is a little bit lighter than the Tech 21, which can give you a higher level of saturation at max.